Hey guys, this is ReefGuy92. We're at the 175. I'm gonna show you guys my nice white sand bed. So if you guys haven't seen my tank before, uh, check out the videos posted previous to this. I think I just posted one two days ago on my tank. It's something you can throw on your TV and have it in the background if you like. You can have my reef in your house, cool. Um, but we are gonna look at my sand bed. That's the biggest thing we're looking at now. It's been over a week since my last video uh, on the Nasaria snails and adding that uh, white sleeper goby. Uh, so let's take a look. So Kemi Clean treatment worked great. The Nasaria snails have been keeping up. The white sleeper goby has been doing a fantastic job. Well, here's a good idea here. That was uh, completely covered in cyano last time I saw this picture and it is a whole lot better. Um, but the one thing I'd have to say about my uh, white sleeper goby is he clouds up the water pretty good. Um, he's a lot of debris in the water, a lot of floating around. The corals haven't been upset about it. Um, everything seems to be just doing fine. But of course, you're not getting that crystal clear water I love to look at. So hoping that the sleeper goby will eventually work his way through the sand, uh, cleaning it out and allowing for less and less debris to be kicked up just because he's going to be picking up less and less debris. Um, the Nasaria snails have been fantastic. Every time I feed, there's about 15 of them that all come out of the sand bag like little zombies and uh, feed through as soon as I drop some food in. So that's pretty cool to see. Makes your sand bag come alive. Um, really, really neat to watch. Uh, corals have been great. Um, again, after the ChemiClean treatment, my skimmer is back to normal now. I gave that all a big wash and uh, I've seen much improvement and now it's actually working and functioning again. I've been very, very happy with the ChemiClean treatment and it's been a lifesaver. This sand bed is a thousand times better than it used to be. And I would say it's 100% reef safe and no issues at all with my tank and the ChemiClean treatment. So here's a little fun fish fact. Can any of you spot the new addition to the tank? Uh, this is a tricky one. It uh, is located on the right side of the tank. Uh, shoot me a message if you guys know what it is. Uh, I'd love to hear if you can figure it out. Uh, it is a new addition, so take a look, see if you can find it. guys for watching I appreciate it um, click on the link to below to subscribe I think I'm gonna have my headshot over here somewhere um, I appreciate it so much uh, all your guys views comments and likes are always a really big help um, feel free to send me comments send me notes if you guys want to see something on my tank feel free to shoot me a message I'll gladly make a video for you guys um, any questions or comments and as a little extra little bit um, I'd love to know your guys' favorite fish. I've been wanting to add another fish to this tank. I had a blue throat trigger. It died, unfortunately. Uh, I'd love to know your guys' favorite fish. I want to add something into this tank that's reef safe, um, that is also going to be good with my tanks, and that's going to get along with all my clownfish and all my little creatures as well. Uh, so shoot me a message. If you guys got any suggestions, I'd love to hear them. Thanks again for watching. Click subscribe, and uh, we're happy to see you guys next week. Thanks again for watching.